RB Leipzig are a young, vibrant footballing side, excellently coached by Julian Nagelsmann. Tactically flexible, melding exciting prospects with seasoned professionals like Peter Colacci and Vili Orban, and benefiting from one of the most astute footballing organisations around. The team is a credible challenge to the Bayern Munich Borussia Dortmund duopoly in German football. And whilst talents like Timo Werner, Tyler Adams, Nordi Mukieli and Christopher Nkunku rightly attract a lot of attention, young Austrian midfielder Konrad Leimer is arguably RB Leipzig's most important player. While Nagelsmann has instituted a slightly less manic press and more of a possession game since taking over at the start of the season, Leimer still stands out as one of Europe's best pressing midfielders. He's also worked on his possession and passing, and at only 23 years old, he's already a key cog in the Leipzig system. Tactically, Nagelsmann is an extremely flexible coach. He tends to adjust his formations slightly from game to game, but favours two basic patterns the narrow 4-4-2 and a 3-3-2-2 that means Leimer is sometimes part of a clear double pivot. Sometimes a sole pivot flanked by wing-backs, but with another central midfielder often dropping to assist. The departure of Diego Demma to Napoli has placed a greater defensive emphasis on Leimer and the midfield, as Demma was more of an anchor who let Leimer push up. But such is Leimer's versatility and talent, he's been able to adjust. In possession, Leimer's role is to assist Leipzig's verticality in build-up play. This means he's an option for the centre-backs as they look to progress the ball or an inside pass for the full-backs. Leipzig like to play up, back and then past, looking to free runners by playing it forwards to a player with their back to goal, like Leimer, who then plays it back with the next pass more vertical to a player in space. Leipzig also used the widest player to create quick passing triangles to work the ball past the first line of the opposition press, and Leimer's ability to take the ball under pressure is key to this. He's also a useful out ball for the winger or wing back, if they're higher up the pitch, and he can then either recycle the ball to maintain possession or look to progress it further with a return pass or via another vertical route. This type of pass situation is reflected in Leimer's stats. According to fbref.com, although Leimer is fifth in Leipzig's list for overall passes made, he's top for passes made while receiving pressure from an opponent. When looked at per 90, he's actually 13th for passes made, but still third for passes made under pressure. When Leipzig are in the opponent's final third, Leimer tends to sit higher than his partner in a double pivot, or act as a screen if he's the sole pivot. His athleticism means he can squeeze up and cover a lot of ground to prevent Leipzig being vulnerable to counters. And he's a useful outball in the right half space from where he can even join attacks. But it's Leimer's defensive work that really stands out. He is a pressing machine. Looking at players who've played 270 minutes or more in this season's Bundesliga, Leimer is second for pressures per 90 and has the best success rate of this elite group. He's also played the most football by some distance. Now the team are geared to press, and Leimer, who has been part of the Red Bull setup since he was a youth player at Salzburg, is well drilled in this. Leipzig's pressing game is match dependent, and so it's tough to break down how the team presses because they adapt a lot. But what is consistent is Leimer's role. He's the midfield sweeper, whether in a single or double pivot, who allows Leipzig's forward players to press high by covering. This means that although he's mostly winning the ball in central areas, or the right half space, he shows up across the pitch. He's constantly aware of the opposition's passing options and looks to push up to close down players or passing lanes. And if he gets out of position, he's athletic enough to continue to chase the ball down while his teammates position themselves to cover. This allows Leipzig to press high and look for turnovers near the opposition goal, safe in the knowledge that the Austrian midfielder is patrolling the space behind, alert and athletic enough to cover the ground. RB Leipzig's excellent start to the Bundesliga season under the hugely impressive Nagelsmann saw them top the table at the Winterpause. Now they've dropped off slightly in pursuit of the title, but are still one of the four teams genuinely in the hunt, driven by the superb Konrad Leimer. If you're following the Bundesliga, you should join Tifo in reading the work of Rafa Honigstein, the Athletic's brilliant Bundesliga correspondent. For an interview with Edmund Tapsoba, a behind-the-scenes piece on Erling Haaland, and the inside story of the league's return, get a free trial of The Athletic. Not only will you get access to the best sports writing online, but in doing so, you'll be supporting us at Tifo in the best way that you can. So, 
please use the link in the description below to sign up for your free trial. And thank you for watching.